How to help your boss see how a coworker is undermining others. A coworker in the workplace that actively undermines you and your other coworkers is a serious issue that needs to be dealt with correctly. Determine if your coworker is actively sabotaging you and your coworkers by taking note of their behaviors and actions. Once you have determined that you have real case to present to your boss, gather the necessary resources in order to present a legitimate case. After gathering the necessary resources, schedule an appointment with your boss to discuss the situation and to decide what the next steps will be to address the issue. Determining whether your coworker is being undermining. Determine if the coworker is hypercompetitive. Sometimes it is hard to tell the difference between someone who is hypercompetitive and someone who is sabotaging others at work. The two are not mutually exclusive. Someone who is hypercompetitive tries to beat out everyone, however someone who is actively undermining others wants to see co-workers fail. They usually do not care about the outcome of the project. Rather, they care more about how they will look in the end, no matter the outcome. Watch for a tendency to steal credit for your work or to blame you for their shortcomings. These are also signs of a coworker who is trying to undermine you. Examine the coworker's activities. Does the questionable coworker gossip a lot and spread hateful rumors about other coworkers? Are they quick to criticize but never offer any solutions? Have you or your other coworkers been bullied by the coworker? For example, a coworker is a bully if they make fun of other people, blame others for problems, and tattle tell frequently. If you answered yes to these questions, then chances are you are dealing with an undermining coworker. If you answered yes to these questions, then chances are you are dealing with an undermining coworker. See if the coworker takes credit for your work. Has the questionable coworker taken credit for your or others' work and or ideas? If you and your coworkers worked as a team to complete a big project and the questionable coworker took most of the credit for its completion without contributing much, then they are taking unnecessary credit for your work. Save all emails where you have contributed original ideas and work. Determine if the coworker oversteps their rank. Oftentimes, undermining coworkers will overstep their boundaries. They will act as if they are superior to you and your coworkers, even if you are all equals. Or, perhaps they tell your coworkers to report to them instead of you. Also, if the coworker is trying to take away your team members, or misguide them, be suspicious about this coworker's intentions. Also, if the coworker is trying to take away your team members, or misguide them, be suspicious about this coworker's intentions. See if the coworker keeps you in the dark. Another telltale sign that a coworker is undermining you or others is if they purposely forget to invite you to a big meeting, don't include you in important emails, or forget to pass along important messages from your boss. This coworker might be actively trying to leave you out, in order to make you look incompetent, distracted, or like you don't care about your job duties. This is especially an issue if there is an upcoming promotion or an empty spot above you too. Think about possible motivations that your coworker could have to keep things from you. If you think your coworker is hiding something, make sure that you are getting the information from others so that you can properly do your job. 